and welcome back to the channel. On this video, I want to talk about a possible crackdown on e-bikes coming. And I saw a report out of California that they're proposing a bill for e-bikes, the legislature could tighten uh, the rules on age for riding e-bikes. Definitely not for anyone under the age of 12. And I thought the age to ride an e-bike really was 16. So uh, that's how much I know. I didn't realize that it was kids 12 years old too that were uh, able to ride or were riding them or under 12. So um, anyway, uh, they're gonna make it totally illegal if this uh, bill goes through for 12 or anyone under 12 years old uh, to ride, which kind of makes sense to me. That's pretty young. If you, you know, 10, 8, 10, 11 years old, say you're hopping on a, a Saran or something, you know. I think that's, you know, that's a little bit much for somebody that young. And uh, so we'll see where that goes. And then also, for anyone who does not have a driver's license, you'll have to, you'll be required to do an online written test and have a state issued ID to prove who you are and all that. And um, we'll see where this all goes, but is this just the start of what's gonna happen? Are we gonna get to the point where we have to pay a registration and insurance for our bikes as well? Now that's just the state of California, but usually where it you know, it starts somewhere and then it, it gains momentum and gets other places too. So we'll see where this goes, but um, it hasn't been voted on yet or anything, so it hasn't been passed. But we'll see where it takes us. <clears throat> I guess they're worried because they've had a lot of issues with young folks riding recklessly. And that's totally understandable. You can't have people riding recklessly. I mean, I, I see lots of people riding down a highway, you know, or a fairly busy street doing wheelies. Um, to me, that's, that's riding recklessly. So we'll see where it goes. But uh, I just wanted to uh, bring that up in case uh, some folks didn't see that, that they're uh, talking about this. Like I say, that's just the state of California, but All it takes is one state to start something and then others to piggyback along, so. I think eventually they're gonna want to uh, get money out of this somehow. Uh, this meaning the e-bike um, world. Would you be willing to pay a registration or insurance for your bike if you have to do it? 
or would that get you out of the e-bike game? I would hope that if we had to pay a fee, that it wouldn't be a lot. Because it could get to a point where it prices people completely out of the e-bike market. I mean, we're trying to get people into the market now um, that find it pricey, which it is. As it is, you know, already pricey. So we don't need to have more prices on top of what we already have to pay to actually purchase the bike. What they should do is maybe take some money off of what you paid for the bike from the uh, the bike seller but then they would just mark up the bike even that much more so I'm sure over the next few years we're going to hear more and more stories and proposals for what to do about the e-bike world so we'll have to see where it all goes I don't know it's it's still kind of early in the game to see there's no definitive direction that we're going we're just kind of going with it right now it's kind of a wild animal I guess you could call it uh, as of right now, there's no direction, so we'll see where it goes. I like it the way it is, as long as people are responsible. You know, I can understand totally on the uh, under 12 years old riding, that's totally understandable. But, uh, you know, I hope they don't get to the point where they just clamp down so hard that it just deters a lot of people from even bothering to try to get an e-bike. If you've got a comment though on this subject, go ahead and leave it in the uh, comments below. And that's going to do it for another video here on the channel. If you like this video, hit that like button. If you'd like to subscribe to the channel, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And thank you very much for doing that. And if you want to be notified as to when the next video comes up on the channel, just hit that notification bell and you'll be notified. And if you want to leave a comment on this or any other video, go ahead and leave that in the comments below. Once again, thank you for joining me for this video. And until next time.